Hello YouTube. Today we're going to make a very easy do-it-yourself surgical operating headlight. It can be used in ENT. Uh, can be used in dental surgery. And any kind of surgery where the surgical lighting in the operating room is uh, not necessarily adequate. And uh, the equipment that you need is. Uh, your glasses, or you just a spare glasses, or your reading glass, whichever you like. This is just a Foster Grand reading glass I got from a drugstore. And you need some uh, zip ties. This is a four-inch black zip ties. A little uh, electrical tape, masking tape, uh, and some uh, super glue. I just get these uh, super glue gels from. Uh, Harbor Freight Tools. So this is a headlight that I got from Amazon. $27, $26.99. Very nice uh, LED uh, headlight. It's made in China. Uh, you can buy these. Uh, there's plenty of them. They sell from uh, $26.99 to like $35 each. They're all the same. It comes with a battery, rechargeable battery with a, with a variable control. It has a charger. There's a charger in here. Uh, has a, the light right here. It it comes with a eyeglass clip. So make sure you order one that comes with the eye eyeglass clip. Just search your uh, Amazon for surgical dental headlight. Uh, you're gonna find lots of them. And uh, two-day shipping if you have uh, Amazon Prime. I got these from. Uh, it's called. Uh, you don't have to have to use this one. You can use any kind. But they're all the same. Different different sellers sell them. Very inexpensive, but excellent quality. Very bright. I'll show you. So here's the light. Turn on. It's extremely bright. Look at that. That's about six feet away on the wall. Very bright. It's a variable power. So I have attached the light to my glasses. And uh, it is on right now. Here's the cord, battery. So what I intend to do is to uh, use zip ties, use zip ties to fix it to the frame of the glass, and then I will use a super glue to glue it to the earpiece. It's a very nice headlight, very well made, super bright, totally adequate for performing surgeries. So I used a 4 inch zip tie to affix the light to the frame, as you can see right here. Then you just snip off the excess. The next thing I do is I uh, masking tape, use the masking tape to tape the lens of your glass so you don't get super glue onto it. And then you glue this wire to the top of the glass to here, stop here. So I super glue the wire to the top of the rim. I did have to put one uh, zip tie there to stabilize it and I taped it down, let it dry up. It won't take too long. The 
the next step is to uh, glue this to all the way to here and uh, make sure you do it in a closed position so your glasses can be folded so there's enough lack, uh, slack right here and then you can start by zip tying to the uh, earpiece so here's the finished product very nice bright operating headlight comfortable to wear unobtrusive very light, lightweight, comfortable I did put a little electrical tape here to for comfort on your ear with the last zip tie and here's the battery now I put the battery in a uh, universal uh, flip phone case so you can wear it on your belt or on your operating and see, see this is variable light variable off on so this light is not only good for surgery operation dental work also you know for people like jurors uh, watchmakers whatever uh, when you need require good lighting in close-up work now I I know you can buy these these types of headlights on medical equipment stores for hundreds if not thousands of dollars here is one I made for twenty seven dollars plus my eyeglass which is inexpensive also and this battery will last several hours all day you know so I have one in each of my exam rooms and I have one in my car so if I go see a patient in the hospital and even do surgery with him you know when the lighting is not the best this sure helps Thank you very much for watching.